Hi, so what I want to do is I, I want to give you an exercise that's pertaining to exercises that help you to see the world in a different way, just like I was talking about in my story about how my, my teacher did something to me and, and allowed me to see the, the world in a very different way instantly. It's like, it's, like I, it's like he gave me the red pill of the matrix. I know that now. At the time, of course, I was just walking out of La La Land. I was only a kid. I was young. And I didn't realize that what he actually did. It was just like I just felt super cool and super good. And, but I'm going to give you an exercise from the, from the heaven to earth system that can take you into the similar place. Yep. And part of it's you've got to let go your mind of what you think it is and just stay inside the exercise and let it be whatever it is without you trying to make it something. Yeah, that's the easiest way to have this experience. Yep. So start with your hands facing towards the ground. Yep. So it's from the heaven and earth system. Take a breath in. It's the exercise for your shang shang, your heart, your heart center, yeah? Or your spiritual center. Take a breath in. And as you breathe out, move the hands to the side. Okay. Take a breath in. And as you breathe out, let the hands float. Good. Now you have your palm of your hands facing towards the ground. And so the energy is coming out both palms into the ground underneath me. Yeah. Take a breath in. And as I breathe out, I'm going to rotate those the energy around, and it's going to now it's going to face towards heaven. Yeah. So now I feel like I'm holding two energy fields from my hands into heaven. Yeah. And take a breath in, and as I do that, now I'm going to roll them. The energy is going to roll down in two big lines. Remember, it's going straight up to heaven. Now it's going to roll down in front of me as we breathe out. Good. Now they're facing from the palm of the hands off into the universe. And they run parallel, they don't touch. They go into the universe. Good. And then to, to join the two ends, what I'm going to do is move my hands slightly, and the ends are going to touch. And then are going to bring them around, and, then, and it's going to come in really quickly through the touching in the middle and bring them around to the hands are touching each other. We're going to do this one more week, so I just want to do this in explanation first. And then when you've got two palms, you can feel the energy of those things that were out there running into each other like they're bubbling in the middle as they meet each other. Then you push your hands together and you make it stronger and then you bring and call sword fingers, two fingers like that, and those two fingers are touching your thumb. Yeah, those fingers touch the thumb and these fingers are touching. You turn back of the fingers to back of the fingers, the both back of the fingers are touching each other, and you point that towards your heart. Yep, and that's how we set it up, and I'll talk you about what's going to happen when we get there. So bring your hands back down again. And we'll do it all in one go, and we'll do it with, through the breaths, yes? So take a breath in. Breathe out, move your hands to the side. And take a breath in. Let the hands flow, breathe out. Connect the energy to the yin of the earth. Take a breath in. Breathe out, rotate the hands, connect to heaven, to yang, to heaven. Hold the universe. Breathe in, expand. Breathe out, rotate the hands to the front. Send the energy across the planet into the, into the universe. Take a breath in. Bring the ends together and then bring the ends back towards each other. And you'll be able to, as you come in, you'll be able to feel a big ball of energy. As you come in, you feel like you're holding this energy between your hands. It's very cool. And then palm of the hands towards palm of the hands. And you're going to push the ball. You're compressing the energy between your hand. You'll feel it. It's, it becomes quite hard to push it in. Yeah. Get to there. And then you change the fingers to sword fingers. Turn the hands around. Point towards your heart. Yeah. Good. Now I want you to take a breath in. Let the whole body expand. And breathe out and relax. Breathe in, let the whole body expand. Breathe out and relax. One more time, breathe in. Breathe out and relax. Let the whole body relax. And take your mind into your heart. And relax inside your heart. Let your body relax, relax your legs, relax your bottom muscles, relax your back, relax your head, relax your feet. Pull your tummy in and breathe out. And as you breathe and let the whole body relax. Do that one more time. Pull your tummy in, breathe out. As you breathe and let the whole body relax. 
Very good. And then open your heart and look out into the world from your heart. And see the world from your heart. And then bring the surplus to you back to your dad. Leave your heart open. Leave it open. Good. And I encourage you in the space, leave it open for a little while. Just experience what it feels like to be open. And know that when it's open, nothing can hurt you. Nothing can touch you. Your heart's protected. Good. And if you want to, you can close it back up or you can leave it open. Very cool. And so that's an exercise. Now you can go back and do that again and build it up again and pack it again and go back to the position. But I encourage you to leave the heart open. And as I said, you, you, it's an idea your heart can get hurt. It's just a concept. It can't. Your mind has ideas of what it is, but it isn't actually that, that your heart can be open and nothing can touch you. Yeah. What, the, what happens to you when you think you get hurt, your mind gets hurt, not your heart. Your mind, because you have a story around the way you think it should be, and then the, you get hurt because of your story, not because of what's happening to your heart. Yeah. The effect is in your heart, but it doesn't come from your mind. When your heart's open, nothing can touch you. Be free, everybody, eh? I'm just going to bow, bow you, and we'll see you on the course, eh? Come and do the course. Amazing, amazing time to change your life. It's a good time in the world to change your life right now. Have a different look. Have a different outlook. Be free. Go. Cool. Come and join me. And you too can open your heart. Feel what it feels like to walk around with an open heart. Bye-bye.